Learning objective uh, include a scope of microbiology and various branches of microbiology. We live in the age of bacteria. First, living organisms were, in fact, uh, bacteria and other microbes on the planet, and they basically created the atmosphere for us. And also, all the bi biosphere basically depends upon their activities. So, um, Various branches of microbiology evolved as the knowledge of microbiology grew. What we see today is bacteriology is the study of bacteria, and it deals with isolation, identification, characterization, and classification of bacteria. Another branch of microbiology is mycology. Mycology is the study of fungi. It includes medical microbiology where the disease-causing fungi are studied, and then agricultural mycology, uh, where the plant diseases are studied, and also ecological mycology that deals with the decomposing of woods, uh, leaves, feces, and other organic matter. Similarly, uh, basic and applied microbiology is another branch. In basic microbiology, we study the biology of microbes, how they behave, what they do. And in applied, we can use the microbes for commercial applications. Medical microbiology is a science that deals with the diseases in humans and animals. And it also involves identification of uh, disease-causing agents, their control and elimination, elimination of microbes, and also tracking down new pathogens that arise from time to time. Epidemiology uh, is another branch of microbiology. It deals with monitoring diseases in a population. What we see, the incidence or prevalence of a particular disease over time. It also uh, tracks the uh, outbreaks and the developing epidemics as a result of the disease. Epidemiology also covers implementation of appropriate control measures and involves surveillance studies. Immunology is a very interesting, uh, another branch of microbiology where we study the immune system, how immune system works, what are various cells, and how they interact with each other, how the immunity is generated, and what kinds of immunity uh, is there? Like we have uh, antibodies and cellular immunity and humoral immunities. Also, vaccines, the preparation of vaccines, making of vaccines also comes under immunology. And use of antibodies for treating diseases and cancer is also a big area in immunology. Food microbiology includes those microorganisms that causes the spoilage of the organisms, how we can prevent that spoilage, and also use of microbes for, <clears throat> human, for human food, creating human food like cheese, uh, bread, yogurt, and wine. Industrial microbiology makes use of microbes for commercial applications, commercial production of uh, chemicals like biomolecules ethanol, methanol, acetic acid, vinegar, and etc. Microbial genetics and molecular biology are the new branches of uh, microbiology. They deal with the gene regulations, and E. coli, bacillus subtilis, and saccharomyces, including viruses such as T4 and lambda, these are uh, study models for genetics and molecular biology. 